ever pondered about the profound impact of obesity on health and how it can alter the course of one's life. The world is grappling with a health crisis of an enormous magnitude, and it's not an infectious disease or a deadly virus, it's obesity, a condition that is often overlooked, misunderstood, or trivialized. But the truth is, obesity is a complex health issue that goes beyond just being overweight. It's a condition that can lead to a cascade of problems impacting every aspect of a person's health and well-being. When we talk about the physical implications of obesity, we're not just talking about extra pounds. We're talking about an increased risk of heart disease, diabetes, and even certain types of cancer. These are life-threatening conditions that can significantly shorten a person's lifespan. But it's not just physical health that's at stake. Obesity can also take a significant toll on mental health. It can lead to feelings of shame, depression, and anxiety. It can impact a person's self-esteem and their relationships with others. It can even affect a person's ability to participate in everyday activities, leading to a diminished quality of life. Furthermore, obesity is linked to a higher risk of developing chronic diseases. As the body mass index increases, so does the risk of high blood pressure, stroke, and sleep apnea. It can also lead to osteoarthritis, a condition that affects the joints and can cause chronic pain and disability. Obesity is a multifaceted issue that requires a comprehensive approach to tackle. It's not just about diet and exercise, although they are vital components. It's about understanding the root causes, addressing mental health issues, and making sustainable lifestyle changes. Obesity isn't just a number on the scale, it's a heavy burden that affects every aspect of health. As we delve deeper into this topic, remember that understanding is the first step towards change. And it's a change that we can all be a part of, for ourselves and for the generations to come. To understand the gravity of the obesity epidemic, let's delve into the numbers. Take a moment to consider this. As of now, more than 2 billion people worldwide are overweight or obese. That's nearly a third of the global population. The frightening part? This number has tripled since the 1970s. What makes these figures even more daunting is the impact on our youth. In the last four decades, childhood obesity has increased at an alarming rate. Today, one in every five children and teenagers is overweight or obese. This early onset of weight issues sets the stage for potential health problems in adulthood, which is a cause for significant concern. But here's the real kicker. Obesity is not just about excess weight. It's a gateway to a plethora of health conditions. From heart diseases, diabetes, to certain types of cancer, the health risks associated with obesity are far-reaching and often severe. Let's talk money for a moment. The global economic impact of obesity is estimated to be about $2 trillion annually. That's nearly 2.5% of the world's gross domestic product. This includes the direct costs of treating obesity-related diseases and the indirect costs of lost productivity due to illness and premature death. If we continue down this path, the future looks grim. If current trends continue by the year 2040, Nearly half of the world's adult population will be overweight or obese. The economic burden, health consequences and human suffering will be unimaginable. The numbers don't lie. The obesity epidemic is a global health crisis that requires immediate attention and action. Ever wondered what factors contribute to obesity? It's more than just overeating. Let's dive into the deep end and unpack the multifaceted causes of obesity. It's a common misconception that obesity is solely the result of overeating or a lack of willpower. While diet and physical activity certainly play crucial roles, they're just part of a much larger picture. To start, let's talk about genetics. Yes, your genes can influence your weight. Some people are genetically predisposed to gaining weight more easily than others. This doesn't mean that obesity is inevitable for these individuals but it does mean that they may have to work harder to maintain a healthy weight. Next, let's discuss lifestyle choices. We live in an age where sedentary activities, such as watching television or working on a computer, have become the norm. This lack of physical activity can contribute to weight gain. Additionally, our food environment plays a significant role. We're surrounded by fast food restaurants, convenience stores packed with processed foods, and marketing campaigns encouraging us to eat more. This can make it challenging to make healthy food choices consistently.
But wait, there's more. Environmental factors also come into play. The environment in which we live can significantly affect our ability to maintain a healthy lifestyle. For example, living in a neighborhood without safe places to exercise or access to fresh, affordable food can make it much harder to stay healthy. And then there's the issue of stress. Chronic stress can lead to hormonal changes that increase appetite and cravings for high calorie foods. It's a vicious cycle that can contribute to obesity over time. Lastly, certain medical conditions and medications can also lead to weight gain. Conditions such as polycystic ovary syndrome, hypothyroidism, and certain psychiatric disorders can contribute to obesity. Some medications used to treat these and other conditions can also cause weight gain. So as you can see, obesity is far from a simple issue of overeating or lack of willpower. It's a complex health issue influenced by a myriad of factors, many of which are beyond an individual's control. Obesity is a complex health issue that cannot be attributed to a single cause. The effects of obesity ripple out, impacting more than just the individual. Imagine a stone tossed into a placid pond. The stone itself sinks, but the ripples it creates spread far and wide, touching everything in their path. Obesity, in much the same way, doesn't stop at the person carrying the extra weight. Its effects reach out, causing tremors throughout society and the economy. Obesity is a heavyweight champion in the arena of healthcare costs. When someone carries excess weight, they are more likely to develop chronic conditions like heart disease, diabetes, and certain cancers. These diseases require continuous care and management, leading to a significant increase in healthcare expenses. But the financial burden isn't limited to individual medical bills. The increased demand for care puts a strain on our healthcare systems, overburdening them and leading to longer waiting times and reduced quality of care for everyone. It's not just about the dollars and cents though. Obesity can also lead to reduced productivity. When someone is grappling with obesity-related health issues, they may find it hard to perform at their best, whether at school or work. This diminished productivity can affect career progression and income potential, creating a vicious cycle of financial instability and stress, which can further exacerbate obesity. Moreover, the societal impacts of obesity are more profound than you might expect. The stigma attached to obesity can lead to social isolation and mental health issues, reducing overall quality of life. This social exclusion can further contribute to the cycle of obesity, as people may turn to unhealthy coping mechanisms. In essence, obesity is not a solitary issue. It's a societal issue, an economic issue, a healthcare issue. It's a ripple effect that touches every corner of our lives, from our personal health to our collective well-being. Obesity doesn't just weigh down the individual, it weighs down society as a whole. And that's something we all need to address together. Change is possible, and it begins with awareness and understanding. So let's talk about the path to change. It's not a quick fix or a magic pill, but a journey of small, consistent steps towards a healthier lifestyle. The first step on this path is regular exercise. It's not about becoming an Olympic athlete overnight, but about incorporating movement into your day-to-day -day life. You could take the stairs instead of the elevator, go for a brisk walk during your lunch break, or dance around the living room with your kids. The key is to find an activity you enjoy, so that it becomes a habit, not a chore. Next. Let's talk about the fuel we put in our bodies. A balanced diet is crucial for managing and preventing obesity. But what does balanced really mean? It's not about cutting out all your favorite foods, but about moderation and variety. It's about filling your plate with colorful fruits and vegetables, lean proteins, whole grains, and healthy fats. It's about listening to your body's hunger and fullness cues, rather than following strict diet rules. But even the best exercise and diet plans can fall apart without a supportive environment. This means surrounding yourself with people who encourage your health goals rather than sabotage them. It means finding or creating spaces where you feel safe and motivated to exercise. And it means seeking professional help if you need it, whether that's a dietitian, a personal trainer, or a mental health professional. Finally, remember that change is a process, not a destination. There will be ups and downs, setbacks and victories. But each step you take, no matter how small, is a step towards a healthier, happier you.
Remember, the journey to a healthier life isn't about achieving an ideal weight. It's about embracing a healthier lifestyle, one step at a time. Because health isn't a size, it's a state of being. And you have the power to change your state of being, one choice at a time.